Wait, everyone! There's a message! Something's happened to Father. Master Jedi, Captain Sully, Belsavis Orbital Security. We have a situation in progress. Senator Grell has been abducted. Witnesses report Grell was leaving a meeting when a heavily armed man took him prisoner. Did this man hurt Senator Grell? We don't know, but the kidnapper killed three guards who got between him and his ship. The system's in place to trap escaping vessels. The main tractor beam, our overrides, they've all been sabotaged. We're fixing them now. But without them, we can't track the kidnapper's ship. And this is a week-long repair job, at least. Senator Grell may not have that time. Now, now, there's more than one way to snare a Gizka. Captain, send any readings you gathered from the hangar. Ooh, let me look. Hmm. Oh, Theron, his engine's using a tripartite ionization chamber. What a rascal. A few atmospheric readings, Jedi. Ten minutes to write an algorithm, and we'll plot the kidnapper's trail. I knew I brought you along for a reason. Besides, it'll be an excellent study for my next paper. I hope you find the Senator safe and sound. We'll double our security measures, Master Jedi. This won't happen again. All right. When Theron finds the kidnapper ship, I I'm going with you. Leave this in my hands. I promise not to let you down. This is my father. I have to be there. Oh, father, please be all right. Of course. Who else would come? So my untraceable engine only bought time. That's fair. I'm Stark. I've gained so much from your senator. I'm here to destroy you, and I don't mean to fail. I do exist on a whim, just not yours. Father, get up! We came to save you! He's not there. He didn't take my questions well. I learned a lot about an Eshkar horde in a prison. The first son will want that. I've been hoping to encounter another child of the Emperor. No, I'm... I was allowed this memory. I was once a great Sith, but I looked into the abyss. I followed the children, and the first son found out. The scalpel and bright lights took my name. Now I serve as Stark. Stop it! Stop talking! You hurt my father! You don't deserve to live! We can't risk him reporting back to the First Son. Interfering in my duties is rude. If I kill you, I might earn my name back. Oh, it's okay. Father? Father, I can heal you. See? My powers can... can save you. No! Not now! Come on! Father! Don't leave me! You did everything you could. We were just too late. This is a bad dream. Or a test? Some Jedi test? Everything's a test. You! You did this! Something like you shouldn't outlive my father! If you want him dead, I won't stop you. I was curious. Is that so bad? It's over. My duty's done. See, Father? I'll be strong for you. Our family, our world. I promise. Would you help me? We can't leave him in this place. We have convened to offer the condolences of the Jedi Order on the passing of Senator Tobus Grell. Nadia, your father was a great ally. We hope you'll continue his noble efforts to guide your people into the Republic. I will, and everyone back home should respect me as a successor. You still have remarkable respect for your people's customs despite your travels. There is another matter. 
Senator Grell's will was left in our care, and one portion concerns both of you. For the Institute of Xenozoology, if they can display it. But finally, my most important concern, my dear Nadia. She is so gifted, but these children of the Emperor are both gifted and trained. Therefore, I ask Nadia be accepted for a Padawan's training, and taught by the Barsenthor of the Jedi Order. We've had time to discuss it, and we consent for Nadia to become your Padawan. This should be a joint decision. Of course. I, I mean, thank you for the honor. Nadia, a Padawan begins with a vow to honor her master and the Jedi Code. Oh, then I promise to follow the Jedi Code and to respect my master and listen to his lessons. And I swear to teach you the ways of the Force, protect you from evil, and remind myself that training is eternal. This is everything Father wanted. He'd be so happy. This proves what the Blasted Empire is capable of. The Ashka won't be enough. We need more. Something... extraordinary. Doolin, every crazy spacer has a story about Voss and those mystics. You want to fight the Empire with legends? Don't dismiss him out of hand. Maybe he's onto something. Rumor says Voss is home to Force sensitives called mystics, who can heal any injury and see the future counter any plan. It's got to be exaggerated, but if there's any truth to it, these mystics might swing a Republic victory. Hopefully the mystics are willing to discuss an alliance. If you truly believe you must go to Voss, be wary. Those mystics may use the Force, but they don't know our ways. Good luck. Senator Grell's death should not be in vain.